New tonight, we've learned the man killed in an overnight boating accident on Buffalo's Outer Harbor was a teacher and union leader in the Lancaster Central School District. Two on your side's Erica Brecker joining us with details on the crash and how this death is impacting the Lancaster community tonight. Erica? Ron, the story has really evolved throughout the day, starting first with the boat crash itself to learning that the man who died, Mr. Eric Prescuta, was a well-known leader in the community. I'm going to take you what we through what we've confirmed happened out on the lake this morning and how colleagues and friends are now remembering the middle school science teacher. Prescuta was one of three people on board a boat that crashed into the break wall near the middle gap of the outer harbor. That's according to the U.S. Coast Guard. Two other men made it to the break wall to call for help, but they couldn't find Prescuta. His body was eventually found on the lakeside of the wall this morning near where the crash happened last night. The Coast Guard says it appeared no one was wearing life jackets and officials say speed may have been a factor in the crash because the boat apparently hit the wall so hard that it left a mark on the rocks. Then later on today, the Lancaster Central School District released a lengthy statement confirming his service as a union president, lacrosse coach, science teacher and father. It also quotes the middle school principal who said he was a highly respected teacher regarded as an advocate for children both in the classroom and on the athletic field. I was able to speak with a colleague of Prescott's in the West Seneca Central School District tonight. He's always standing up for his students, standing up for his members. A dedicated family man, a uh, strong, strong personality, a uh, strong leader. Uh, be terribly missed. It's a, it's just shocking, terrible news. Throughout the day, we've seen colleagues and people in the teaching community remembering him on Twitter. Uh, several people saying that he is a tremendous loss, both within the union and within the school community. Uh, he had a brother who was also a teacher has a brother who's also a teacher in the school district, along with many students, athletes, teachers, all of whom were friends with him and say his loss is just tremendous to the school district and the community. We've learned through the school district that grief counselors and emotional support staff will be present in all of the school buildings tomorrow to help both faculty and students. Erica Brecker, Channel 2 News.